Hey, what's up, guys? You're here with Kirk and Gora from Big Dogs, and thank you for joining us here for your free pick for the matchup between Germany and Hungary on Wednesday, uh, June 19th. Uh, we do have a few more games uh, on Wednesday on the schedule, and you can find free picks for that up on the Big Dogs YouTube channel, of course, guys. Uh, check out our best bets uh, in the Pink Dogs Premium section and check out that Golden Boot VIP access. Simply text the word gold to the number above and get all the information you need. If you're one of those high bettors, high rollers that bets $500 and above, this is the way to go for you guys. Uh, now, Kirk, uh, I know that you like Germany. I know that's your favorite team. Uh, I see you have a jersey on. Uh, and uh, they were one of those teams who started the tournament. The the right way the proper way they scored five goals against scotland they probably could have scored a couple more if i'm being honest especially in the second half and uh if i'm being honest of all the big teams they were the most impressive team uh in round one even though they played against scotland but this is going to be a bit of a different game because hungary is not a bad team and uh they are definitely due for a nice performance after that weak weak display against switzerland yeah, it's hard to stay um, humble, let's say that, after that Germany win. And now I'm going to try to not give you guys a biased um, take here. I actually do think Hungary is a solid team here. I was a little bit disappointed by them in that first game. And Germany, I mean, everyone's riding a high right now in Germany. Literally everyone I know there, all my family, all my friends there. But... We do know what has happened to Germany in the past. I don't, wouldn't get too high on them, but I'm looking at a player prop in this game. I'm looking at Ilkay Gundogan to score or assist. He had probably three great chances in that first game. He was really involved every time it got into the box, and he is Germany's penalty kick taker. I know Kai Havertz took that, but Gundogan was hurt in that play, so he wasn't ready to take that. And I mean, add that in with an assist with all the talented guys you have that he's passing the ball to. I think they score at least two goals in this one, Germany. So Gundogan to score or assist is my play here. Yeah, that's not a bad play. And I I mean, I actually watched the game in the German club here in, in Canada. And it was quite exciting. And uh, a lot of the people are saying that uh, they don't expect Germany to go all the way because they don't have a proper striker. And I'm thinking to myself... Tell are you talking about, guys? You have five different scorers in this game against Scotland. You have Musiala, you have Florian Wirtz, you have Kai Havertz, who uh, can score goals, but he's that, that let's call him a bounce striker or whatever, that uh, can definitely keep the ball and then distribute it. And then, of course, you have Niklas Fulkrug up front. That guy's a tank. What other type that of striker do you need? Goal. Do you really need another, like, a classic striker? Okay, I know in the past you had Miroslav Klose, who, let's be honest, alongside uh, Pippo Inzaghi was one of those classic strikers that are just not being produced anymore. But uh, with an atomic lineup like German has right now, I'm honestly thinking they could go all the way. They have the depth, they have the quality. I mean, they have two of the five best goalkeepers in the world. So... I don't know what are we talking about. They're solid defensively. Uh, and uh, in this game, I think that they will dominate the possession. I think that Hungary might try to do something, try to outpace them. But uh, with so much experience and talent that, that this Germany team has, I think that they will dominate. They will create a lot of chances once again. And uh, I'm going to take Germany to win it over two and a half goals here. It's minus 133. It is a bit juiced. Yes, I'm sure the price will go even higher than this. But uh, as of right now, I like the price, and I will go with that pick. Yeah, you, you also have to remember that Rudiger scored. So Germany had six goal scorers in this one, but he didn't know what, which uh, goal to shoot at. So maybe he even scores in this one. But, I mean, I'm going to be backing Germany, but this is, this is a tougher game than most people will expect here. As if Hungary loses this game, they're basically sent home already. So... Yeah, that's what all I have to say. Here, go Germany. We're taking it home. We already are home. <laughs> you are keeping it home. Yeah, it's staying here. Yeah, it's not going to England. <laughs> <laughs> uh, there you have it, guys. Thank you for joining us here. Uh, once again, feel free to leave a comment on, on any of these videos. Kirk and I will definitely reply to most of those comments unless we see them. 
unless we don't see them before the game time but we, we always try to check the comment section and of course give any any of the information that you might ask for uh, stuff like that uh, i hope you have a great day everyone uh, of course good luck with all of your bets let's let's enjoy some great soccer and uh stay tuned for more free picks coming up soon